going on everybody right now it's kind of like a blizzard here like I'm not even joking to you it's coming down like crazy I can't even believe it so I'm basically stuck inside there's nothing I can do and you know I've been trying to put up a video here for about a week or so a week and a half and I just got this new camera and I made the last video with it it was fine there was nothing wrong with it it was working great uploaded the video and whatnot so then I filmed whole nother segment I was gonna do another skit and it's not reading it's like not picking up my camera on my computer so I thought it was the firewire cable so I got a new firewire cable waited like a week just got it today it's still not picking up the friggin camera so using the old camera the old one I'm using is like a Sony Hi8 I mean it has decent quality video and everything but I mean I got this one it's just a little mini DV cam but whatever it's the Sony you see it DCR HC52. It's just like a little mini DV Sony. I mean, it, like I said, it's brand new. I just had it for like a few weeks now and made one video. Now it's not working. I don't know if it's the Firewire port or what, but it's driving me nuts. So I just decided to make a video with this old one still. And, you know, I was going to do another skit, but what the hell? I th While I'm here, I just do a little like DVD update, kind of update you on some stuff. Um, I just got this in the mail today. Really psyched. I've been waiting for this for a while. It's the Complete Toxic Avenger. Seven DVDs. It is awesome. I mean, I've seen the first one before. Whatever. Before I got the set. I haven't seen the other ones. So I popped that one in today. Just rewatch it. Great. Classic Troma. Wow. This is actually my first Troma DVD. I have another one on the way, I'll do that in another video, but it also has the complete Toxic Crusaders, like, cartoon series, it's awesome, really, really happy to get that. This one, is pretty hard to find, it usually goes for a lot of money, but I found this on eBay for like, five bucks and I couldn't pass it up, it's Night of the Demons 3, I know, yeah, it's not the greatest movie in the world, but I mean, it's a third sequel to Night to to Night of the Demons. So I mean, what do you really expect? But anyways, I got this for five bucks, so I can I'm not complaining at all. I'm pretty sure this is out of print, and it goes for a lot of money. So I'm really happy to have that. This is another out of print one. I had to get this. This movie's so good. I don't care what anybody says. It's Neon Maniacs. I was so happy to get this one of this for a long time and just couldn't find the right deal on it and I just picked it up oh, 15 bucks I paid great movie great 80s cheese I mean there's not really a reason why the neon maniacs are going around killing people and it kinda doesn't really sum it up I mean I'm not gonna spoil the movie for you at all but it's, it's great great movie well, these are big lots of buys I just picked up recently. Um, haven't got a chance to see this one yet. If you've seen it before, let me know. It's called Altered States. Looked pretty interesting. Little snap case there. This next one. Heard of the movie, haven't seen it. What the hell, three bucks. It's Wolfen. I've heard good things about this, so, yeah. This one I was really happy to find. I just commented on a DVD Fiend's video when he was showing his that he got a Big Lots, and I was like, man, I'm jealous. I wish my Big Lots had that. So I went in there the same day and found it. I was psyched. It's the Hammer Mummy film with Peter Cushing and Christopher Lee. I love this movie. I'm a huge Hammer fan. I just... I haven't gotten around to getting some of their movies. Really happy. Three bucks. This one, uh, there's this video store going out of business close to me. So I went and they were getting rid of all their stuff. So I went and picked up, honestly had everything. I only picked up three DVDs, which was, wasn't great. But whoops, <laughs> whatever. First one I got was uh, Bruiser, George A. Romero movie. I haven't got to see it yet, but I mean, it's George Romero. This is the only one they had. All their DVDs were going for five bucks, so I just snagged this. 
Next one I got was MGM Midnight Movies. It's uh, the Dunwich Horror. It's like a HP Lovecraft story. Don't know much about it, but I love these MGM Midnight Movies. So I just figured, you know, get these while you still can, because they're not going to be in print forever. And uh, last one I got is Feast. I've seen this like back when it came out, and I enjoyed it a lot. Just uh, never bought it. Case probably nothing even in it. Yeah. Then the other day I was uh, out at the. It's an FYE. Uh, it's just like a chain. Well, I know a lot of you guys out in California and stuff don't have them, but it's like just a big chain, like a music store, DVDs and all that. And I picked up. Uh, they were buy three years get one free, so picked up Feast Two. I have never seen this one. It's still sealed. Yeah. Found this. I was so psyched to get this. I've been wanting this for a while. That's The Brood, the Cronenberg movie. <laughs> I watched it the same night I got it. It is great. Oh my lord. This movie is awesome. Just what I expected. Cronenberg's great. This one is, uh, heard a lot of things about this. A lot of people love it. Some people didn't like it, but I enjoyed it actually. It was, uh, it was pretty good. Frontiers, uh, After Dark, Horror Fest DVDs. Um, it's a French film, so everything's subtitled. Which I mean, I don't know about you, but I kind of got to be in the right mood to watch something with just subtitles. But uh, it was really good, you know. Definitely, that was the one I got for free, so I can't complain at all. This last one definitely like the best buy of the day it was it, I kind of got it knowing it was going to be cheesy I didn't know really much about it I've heard of it before had to pick it up seen the trailer a million times and that's uh Blackula his bite is out of sight <laughs> this movie was great I don't care what anybody says Blackula I guess there's a sequel too I gotta get that this is <laughs> For what it is, I mean, you, you're gonna think it's like a parody or whatever, but it's not. It's actually like a serious movie. Um, <laughs> guy's name's Mama Waldy in the movie, and he's actually black. <laughs> I don't know. Honestly, just maybe I'll review this one day. This is a great movie, and my birthday's coming up in a couple weeks. And I know it's not my birthday yet, but my parents got me something. I thought it was really cool. Um, I'll just show you. It's right behind me here. This one, it got me, uh, this is the Return of Swamp Thing poster, the video release poster. It's very awesome. This is probably one of my all-time favorite movies. I ended up framing this one. Very, very cool poster. Love it. Took the place of that Omen poster that was there. And this next one, sorry about the shaky camera, by the way. This next one is just as cool if not cooler but it was like an inch too big so for that frame so I gotta wait till I get a new frame and that is it's the original Swamp Thing poster one sheet anybody that knows me knows I'm a huge Swamp Thing fan like beyond belief I love Swamp Thing the movies I should probably do a video on my comics one day so I have a lot of Swamp Thing comics. So yeah. Well that's about it guys. Hope you enjoyed my little video. I hope to have a new video up soon. Back to some funny stuff hopefully. And thanks for watching.